Welcome back everybody, it's time to lock down some more arena. We're playing some more mill. We're going against Echoes. Looks like we got a decent hand with some unsummons to replay our Murphic Secret Keeper a bunch. Can barely talk. Um, or do we want to... You know what, I'm gonna actually just opt, see if we can find a Drowned Secrets. Don't really want that. Another opt, okay. That's fine. Yeah, if we can find a Drowned Secrets, I'd rather play that, get double value for the Merfolk Secret Keeper. Uh, I think we're playing Breeding Pool, this could be Simic Flash. Uh, let's just opt again. I'm gonna do it on my turn, because I don't want to go into a negate or anything like that. Wall of Lost Slots, okay. Let's start the mill. I had to take the chance trying to find the Drowned Secrets. If this is Simic Flash, this is a fun matchup. I, uh, run Simic Flash in paper. So, we're <laughs> these two decks are what I run in paper right now. I run Mono U Mill and I run Simic Flash, and both are excellent. Mono U Mill is super fun. Simic Flash is really fun. Uh, don't... Uh, maybe this isn't Simic Flash. Uh, I don't know what is running that, honestly. So, let's just play out our creatures. Start moving a little bit more. Can't defend against this fair, this pixie. We might try to unsummon it before they can, like, use it for mana or whatever. We may use it for mana this turn, though. Maybe it'd be better just to play Wall of Lost Slots and to unsummon this pixie. Ah, they didn't need it anyways. So they had the three mana for Oko, which is unfortunate. Very unfortunate. One bite, and all your ah, alright. How are we going to deal with this Oko? I do not know. I do not know how to do this Oko. I guess we're just gonna try to mill him super hard. I'm gonna do it this way, so they don't necessarily shut off my Secret Keeper. They tr could turn it into a 3-3 Elk. Which I wouldn't mind, but I would love to just keep replaying this and unsummoning it, just to keep milling. We have them to 33 cards already. So, we get in places. We doing things. Need a Vantress in this matchup. Vantress is... semi-useful. I mean, it's our only thing that can attack into Oko, so... And even then, it's really hard, because he just turns it into an Oko. That's unfortunate. We have no counter spells for any of this, so... It's just... kind of unfortunate that this is happening. Uh, so, can we stave off damage to mill them for 33 cards? That's the question. We've got to run away together. Uh, that we will probably use next turn. Another wall of lost thoughts. Let's do this. We'll block some stuff. Put their token... Make it disappear, make it go bye bye And just continue to try to mill them out. We'll re-get our Wall of Lost slots, and we'll replay it next turn. Play it our Secret Keeper, then unsummon it, then play it back out, and then play Wall of Lost slots. Uh, actually, we won't have the mana for that. We need one more land to do that. Nonetheless, we're running out of options. Uh, this might be a faster concede from me, just for the sheer fact that we don't have anything to, to deal with this. 28 cards. I'm gonna mill them for another 8 next turn, potentially. Go to 20. Mm, I don't know. They're gonna just keep making these crazinesses. Uh, it's gonna make a food token, sure. It's not poison. Thumbnail? Nisu shakes the world? Thumbnail? The I can block everything but the fairy. Ah, I don't like all this mana tapping. Oh, tapping the lands. This is gonna be ugly. 
Holy frick, what are you about to play right now? Uh, Krasis? Probably a Krasis. I was forgetting what they had in their deck. Ah, the Ferocious. Okay. Guess that's going back to your hand. Potentially. Yeah, we're gonna send that back. Goodbye. That works for now. Now you're a little bit tapped out. Another wall of lost thoughts. Well, that's interesting. I think we're just going to play these out and hold up unsummon, probably for this Hydra again. Chances are they're going to put it back out. Down to 23 cards. Uh, if we can stave off jam damage long enough, we might be able to pull this through. What do we kind of need? We need a finisher. We need like another secret keeper to keep doing this. The land shall conquer you. Yeah, it's nutty. Nisa's nutty. Everything's nutty. We're gonna pretend like we gave up. GG. We give up. They're not attacking in, which is good. It's really helping us that they're not attacking in. Uh, I need a counterspell next turn. That's what I definitely need. I need a counterspell to, like, do this crap. You gonna double or you gonna fight? Double. Twenty twenty. Look at that. Look at them there, Hydras. They gonna be mad. They gonna be mad today. What are you gonna do? You gonna forget about your Oko? Hopefully. Nah, you didn't forget. We didn't forget. One life, and all your Goodbye, Hydra. Gone. <sighs> that is not what I needed. That is not what I needed. 19 cards. 19 cards. <sighs> Alright. They're going to bring out their Hydra again. It's going to be insanely big. It's going to be like 25-25 or something nasty crap or maybe they'll second guess it and they'll just start swinging alright lands have indestructible we don't really care uh, we're just gonna chump block them anyways you know I'm gonna start caring uh, if they start getting to be 4-4s four so then I'll start caring right now they're 3-3s three so They could go for a smaller Hydra here now. They don't get double mana anymore from Nisa. They're probably going to start going aggro. My guess. I invite you to change your ways. And why shouldn't they? You know, they can start swinging in for some damage. They have six mana, though. They are going to drop this. Okay. Fight a creature, probably. Get rid of one of my guys. Yeah. Alright. Cool. Okay. 12 cards. Gosh. Dang it, dude. If we, if we could just draw a decent card, we would be able to wrap this game up, I'm sure. Like, for serious, we, we would be... Milling them to like nine this turn if we got like another on summon or going down 
to like five. Now at this point, they're gonna start swinging in for like. Oh, they took one of my creatures. So that's funny. Well, you gave me some life. That'll help me survive. Ugh. That's gonna be so. Probably fight. Resolve. Now they can swing with a lot here. I don't know if we die or not. I'm not really worried about doing the math at the moment. Uh, well, I guess I should be. Uh, let's see. 8, 11, 14, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay. Yeah. That's awesome. Let's crack this. Give me some more life, please. I am just gonna block some of the three threes and take the rest. Ow. Wow. Wow. What was that? Three lands in a row? That's just unlucky. That's just unlucky. Negate, transmutation, goodness matchup, brazen's good. We're gonna take out, run away together, unsummon I would like to keep. We're gonna remove a shock, sock, a little sock. Maybe Jace, Jace isn't entirely necessary. Uh, what else? How did we run this last time? Drown secrets, negate, Vantress, Wall of Lost Thoughts, Brazen, keep all those. I guess we go down on one Kazmina's, go down on one on Summon, go down on one Drown Secrets. I don't really want to do that. We could drop a land. Let's drop a land. Let's see how that works. Sure. I don't know. We got really unlucky that game. We got him down though. What do we have him to? Like ten cards, eleven cards? Man, if we had if those lands were just other spells that could mill, it would have been really close. I don't know if we would have won, but it would have been really close. Keep easy keep. Overwhelmed apprentice. Let's scry into like a drowned secrets or something else of use. Uh, preferably like a counter spell. Yeah, a counter spell would be nice. Yeah, yeah. Let's put those to the bottom. I want to just go for a counter spell. That's really all I want to do. We'll play out secret keeper, or we may even hold up brazen. Get hold up brazen. Get the goose. Okay. Another land. Yuck. We could go for an unsummon. Might actually be worth it. Let's mill him. And then... Unsummon. We'll create another food token, but we'll get him off any crazy Oko plan. I don't care if they have another food token. I'm not worried about their life total. Could be a mistake, too, to do that, but... Uh, they could easily get Oko. Turn three o turn two Oko with that out, so... Looks like we made the right move. So we got our Secret Keeper. Again, our hand is pretty crappy. We'll attack into this Paradise Druid. Why not? I really would like a negate here. Or a counter spell, and they're probably gonna drop an Oko. Wicked Wolf. Ooh. Okay. That's gnarly. I'm gonna have them sacrifice this food token before they fight something. Or are they not even gonna worry about it? Um. Let's return it. Stave them off as long as we can. 
This might be a quick 2-0 from them, though. There's just not a lot we can do. Alright, well, there's something. Let's go... Mill? We're a long ways away. 41 cards. Uh, we'll hold up Brazen Borrower. Why not attack in, you know? Why not? So this isn't Bant, this is just Simic food, right? Simic Oko, Oko Simic, Simic Oko Boko. We didn't see any other colors, right? I don't think we did. Sure, take out something. I'm gonna put down my brazen and start swinging in overhead. Alright, my secret keeper goes bye bye Sounds like a plan, man. And it doesn't even kill him. I don't know why they didn't just do the apprentice. What are they planning on doing? That's kind of silly. Why not take out my apprentice, you know? For some reason, I was thinking this was going to die, too. Maybe they were just on the same line of thinking that I was. Let's opt. Oh, man. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll keep that. Let's... Let's start getting our grind on a little bit, you know. While we can, we're gonna we're about to go empty-handed, which isn't pleasant. We're gonna put them to 38 cards. And we're gonna swing in for three. So we got a little bit of an aggro going here. Which is nice. I got blockers for your Wicked Wolf. I'm swinging in with this Brazen. I don't know what you're looking at here, but... There we go. Alright. What else you got in your hand, huh? Gonna play the Gilded. That's actually a pretty good sign. Uh, kind of tells me there's not a lot going on with their deck right now. With their hand. Not a whole lot of power happening in their hand. They got some flying to protect against Brazen. Um, luckily, it's not gonna kill her, her dude. We could Casmina one of these guys. Or the wolf. I think we just cast me into the wolf. The wolf can, uh... Can get pretty nutty. Um... Or do we just hold on to it? I might just hold on to it for now. The wolf isn't really a danger to us yet. I think I'm just gonna hold my horses on that. I could play a Krasis or something crazy and really put the works on us. That would be a better target. Gonna crack their food. Why not, right? Crack it. Block with Gilded. Go on. Go on. Crack it. See, there's not much we're gonna be able to do with their life total, even if we are on the aggro plan. Which is funny. Uh, I guess they want their Gilded Gooses to really crank something. Yeah, that makes sense. See, in my paper version of this, I play with full four play sets of each of those counter spells. We should be drawing counter spells. We still got a lot of them in here, but where are they? Where are they? You know? What do you got for me? You're gonna swing in? What kind of a plan is that? Block. Oh, he's just gonna put a counter on it. Um, 
then I'll just take the three. And if that's the way we're going this way, we're going to Kazmina's transmutation on that B. Now they're cranking food, so I think it's safe to Kazmina this time. I just wanted to wait a turn and make sure they weren't going to play like a Krasis or something. And they still probably could, but now this is a good target. Oh. Okay. Let's get double crank in here. Where are they at now? Okay, we're still pretty far away. This is this is a challenge, especially with Nisa on the board. Uh, we will swing at Nisa. It's probably going to have to get chump, chump blocked by the Gilded Goose. It's at six, though. It's ridiculous. Can't even kill it in like two turns, which is insane. All right, Brazen Borrower at Nisa, letting it happen. Just doesn't care. No respect for the Brazen Borrower. Nisa can take the hit. Alright, 29 cards left. It's been slow going. I need them to not play anything crazy this turn, but it looks like they are. They're gonna go for that Hydro. Hydra. Hydro Hydra. What do we need? My elemental friend. <sighs> Alright. Made a forest tap the forest. Do the forest, crack the forest. Seven mana up. Uh huh. Crack for the blacken. What is... Alright. Gain a bunch of life, they got a flying 6-6 six, six creature, so... That's why Nisa took the hit. So, what are you going to allow us to do? This is why I want to hold on to the transmutation. Oh, that sucks. Yeah. It's GG now. It's a GG now. Next turn, they can swing in for... Good amount. We're getting the milling. You know, we're in the, we're kind of starting to be in the same same position we were last game. I just think it's not gonna make too much of a difference. The outcome of this game has already been pre-decided for us. Just based on them playing Simic Food with Oko and Nisa. That's all there is to it. 17 cards left, though. That's all we gotta do is 17 cards. We need uh, some unsummons. Just keep unsummoning their creatures. Be wary of the ground you walk what can you hit me for? 3 through 3, I block all. Block, get hit for 6. I'm only getting hit for like 6 this turn. For more. Definitely gonna fight a creature here. It is a secret keeper. Just too strong. It's too strong. I'm glad. This is a reason why I'm glad I'm not playing Arena that much, because who the frick wants to deal with this crap, you know? Like, really? We're swinging in with your Paradise Druid? I guess it doesn't matter. I know all of you have been dealing with Oko like crazy on uh, Arena. And standard's just been a mess for it, but I don't play arena that often. I only do it when I'm like recording videos for the most part, because that's all I have time for. And GG. Good game. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Leave a like on the video. Sympathy likes for us facing Oko again. I uh, couldn't even get a win on him this time. We got lucky last time and got a w one win. Went one and two last time, but this time they two owed us. Just too strong. Too strong. We had really crappy draws. Really crappy draws. 
That's all. That's all it was too. We were drawing too many lands last game. We might have been able to get a win last ge uh, first game if we had not drawn four lands in a row or whatever it was. But hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe if you want to watch some more mono you mill, and stay tuned for some slivers and other content coming out. We will see you guys in the next video.